Hello everybody, this is Perky, and welcome back to another video on my channel. Today we're going to be doing the Walkabout Mini Golf Hidden Balls in 20,000 Leagues Under the Sea. So, um, let's go ahead and play. So, yeah. Pretty nice, pretty nice. Alrighty, so looks like we got a submarine or something, or are we going up to the submarine? Let me look at this real quick. This is cool. Alright, let's not get sidetracked. Alright, our first hole, uh, we'll go in here, and if you want to go ahead and walk, like, well, you'll be facing the stairs if you click the triggers, but what you want to do is you want to turn around, and you'll see the flag, walk forward, turn right, and look right here at this table, and you'll find your first lost ball, ball, sorry, alright. Now for number two, I remember what button to press to get a bigger view. Oh, well that's easier. Okay. Oh, well, okay. Hmm. All right. Well, number two, what you want to do is you will go down the embankment here down this little steps and you will make your way over to these chairs and look right here on the far right side of these u-shaped or v-shaped chairs here and just right here up this leg you'll find a nice anchor ball all right now on to number three number three Okay, number three, you want to make your way down the hallway and into this one only open door here in the middle. You'll see it's like a bunk room or sleeping quarters, and you'll see your ball right here off to the side of the ladder here on the right wall. It's a nice gray scale type ball. Alright, now we'll just go ahead and go to number four. Four, um, you'll face this way, of course, but you will go ahead and turn to your right. See, if you spawn here, you'll spawn, well, let me just do that again. If you spawn on four, you'll be facing this way. So you just want to turn to your right, and you see the steam vac. Go to the steam vac, make another right, and then go straight, and you'll see this ball here on top of the crate. It's just a normal, well, it's an emoji ball. It's a sad emoji ball. <laughs> Alright, I thought it was like a normal orange ball, I guess not. Alright, number five. You will go ahead and make your way down the hallway here. And you will look over here. Well, if I can move. You will look over here on the chandelier. And right here in this little crevice of the chandelier. At the, um... One, two three, four, right here, the fifth light, around here, you want to go ahead and grab your ball, it's a nice multicolor pink, purple, and blue ball, alright, this is number five, I believe, yes, now we'll go to number six, Six, you just want to make your way 
over to the left side of this little dial and um, whatever that thing is called again valve thing when you look over to the left here like you're looking at the ladder in this hallway here you look over to the left and you'll find your next ball which is kind of like a scale of the colored ball you just had at hole five Number seven. Hole number seven will be all the way down past this last thing of pipes, and you will make a right here. It's a full turnaround. Basically, a 90 degree turn, and you will walk here up towards the pipe. It will be right here. Nice and deep print, black and white ball. Alright. So now we go to number 8. Mix is right over here. There it is. Oh god. Ball number eight will be after you pass the shaky bridge, right, I uh, believe, yep, right here in this flower pot on the left side. If you're looking back past to the um, shaky bridge, if you're walking the right out from the shaky bridge, you will be looking at the plant on your right, and you'll have your nice little chromatic, shiny, like chrome gray ball. Alright, we go to number nine. Number nine, it's a little bit tricky. Um, you want to go ahead and make your way over to, okay, from the from where you spawn, and you're looking at the Oregon. You want to look over to the right to this little couch area over here. Make your way over to the couch and these two pillows here. And between these two pillows, you will find your next ball, which is a musical um, note ball. All right. Now we go to, I think, 10. You are in the foyer dining hall area. So you just want to make your way over to the table. And it will be right here. There it is. Oh, there it is. You want to make your way to right here in the middle of the squid. You'll find your next ball. It's a nice, looks like a topographical chromatic brown ball. Alright. So it'll be right there in that squid. So we're on to number 11. Number 11 will be over here, down by this vent right here. It's a nice rainbowy, orange, light orange, yellow, blue, and dark blue. Okay, number 12. You want to go ahead and make your way past the hole here. So just like the squid arm, just walk towards the squid arm. Make a left, and I believe, hold on. Yep, it's right here. It'll be right here in this big plant bucket. Nice blue and black striped ball. Okay. 
Number 13. Well, number 13 is kind of easy. I mean, this is like the kitchen um, preparation, food, prepare, food preparation area and outside the uh, dining area. You just will go in here and look over to the right and just bucket of fish. And you'll find this nice sushi ball. All right. Number 14. This is pretty easy. It'll be right here. You'll see it. It's right here in this wide collection. It's a nice fluorescent blue and black starred ball. So right when you spawn into this hole, look over to your right and you'll see it right there in the wine cabinet. All right. So number 15, you want to go ahead and make your way over to this little reading nook. And your ball should be, I believe, right, right here. Right between this little orange, green, and yellow, like, inkwell thingies, I think. And, or potions. So it'll be looking from this area here where you hit your ball. You'll be making a left, walk straight over to this table. And right here between this green powder... Let me go down a little bit. I'm sitting on the table. Be right here. It's a nice gold and black ball. Alright. Number 16. Hole number 16, you want to go ahead and make your way over to these barrels as you would spawn in here. And you can get your ball down that way. You will make your way down to these stairs here, down to these barrels, and then go right here. I mean, of course, I'm really small right now, but it'll be in the middle area here of these barrels. And then you'll find your ball right there. And it looks to be just a regular white ball. I don't know, it looked kind of pinkish too. But, that was number 16, we got two more, so we're going to number 17 now. Okay, this is the diving pool area, it looks to be. It looks like we got a huge ass squid arm coming up to get us. So what you will do is you will, uh, besides looking at the squid arm, you will make your way over to the diving suits. Make a left, and you want to look down here. At the ladder, we'll just stuff it up and kind of look down. But you see all this, like, see, looks like seaweed and a barnacle down at the very bottom. You want to go ahead and grab your ball. It's a nice submarine type ball, I believe. Or it looks like a uh, Cyclops diver's helmet type ball. Alright, and now for your final hole. Yeah. You want to go ahead and go to, of course, hole 18, which is the Kraken. Oh, wow. Alright, you want to make your way around the Kraken here. Careful not to get eaten by him. You want to go ahead and make your way up to this other platform over here. And your ball, I can barely see it because I, my lower level is kind of weird right now. But your ball will be up here in this furnace. It's a nice, looks like fluorescent green and white ball. So yeah, that is all your balls at 20,000 leagues below the sea. I hope everybody enjoyed this video and enjoys playing this new course. I will hopefully do a video on this course soon. And 
once I get done with this video, I plan to try to find all the balls in the other tours that I get, get them to. So, other than that, like I said, hope you enjoyed it. And other than that, also, we'll go back to the home menu and watch the balls come in. Alright, here we go. Well, I'm gonna choose. I'm gonna choose this one. So yeah, like once again, like I said, if you go down to enjoy this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. Other than that, I'll see everyone in my next video. Bye.